Okay, welcome back to another episode. Today we are going to be spearfishing from Scarborough. So Scarborough in Brisbane. I just got down here to the water and a couple of sparrows just came out and said the visibility is shit house. So I'm just waiting it out for a little while. I'm going to wait for high tide. Currently quarter to nine, high tide's at 10. So I'll probably give it another 15 minutes and then go for a look-see. Uh, it's only the second time spearing Scarborough, so so have a look see see what's in there and i'm also keen to try out my new blades so i got some ruku composite blades so pretty keen to check those out so yeah give another 15 and then we'll hit the water I was soon in the water with visibility around 2 metres. The plan of this day trip was recon. With this only being my second spear in Queensland waters, I was keen to cover some ground and check out the terrain and fish life in the area. As I was diving alone and there was a lot of boat traffic, I hugged the coastline and started to explore. As I continued to explore, I started to get onto some fish. But they were all safe from my spear. Plenty of brim were kicking around. After a couple years of living in Brisbane, it's great to finally get out and explore this underwater world. and I ended up settling on a gold spotted sweetlip for the dinner plate, which surprisingly wasn't that bad. So it ended up being a good dive with 
plenty of areas covered and a better understanding of the fish life and terrain in the area. Towards the end of the dive, I also managed to run into this guy. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. It was a bit slower, but starting out, trying to find new ground, uh, it's all part of the kind of the recon stage. So, what I'm planning on doing is a few more videos like this, I suppose, as I head around Brisbane, try and find some spots, predominantly shore diving. Uh, I don't have a boat, so. When the weather, viz, and that all play the game, I uh, plan to check out a few more spots up and down the coast. And yeah, I'll probably just put some little videos together like this uh, just to show you how I'm progressing, what I'm finding, uh, the conditions that are working, conditions that aren't working, and I suppose hopefully get onto a few fish. I did on this video shoot a gold spotted sweet lip. Uh, I did eat it, and it wasn't too bad, but probably going forward, I'll be trying to up my game a little bit with my target species. Uh, being in the water in Queensland for you know, only the second dive, there are a lot of fish that I'm not familiar with, so I'm going to start doing a little more study, trying to familiarise myself with Queensland fish uh, and what I should be targeting. So, the main fish I came across on this trip, you know, plenty of broom, gold spotted sweet lip. There was one fish that I wasn't sure what it is, so if you look back in my video, I did put a little comment do you know what it is so if anyone knows what that was let me know and yeah so i hope you enjoyed like i say a little bit slow to start off with but hopefully i'm gonna get into it it was great to get back in the water and yeah keen to check out a few more spots i've heard around about the seawall down by the gold coast and also i to get up to the sunshine coast but yeah once again it's just time and weather and and viz uh from what i've read the big issue around brizzy is viz so when all those conditions come together uh, i plan to get out there so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit that like button. And if you want to hit see more, please hit subscribe. Hey guys, have a good one.